Hello Eurovision fans, hola all Portuguese fans, welcome to my channel. Now we're going to talk about the performance of the Black Mamba in the semi-final number two. But first of all, please don't forget to like this video, to subscribe and to comment. Okay, talking about the Black Mamba and their spectacular performance. First of all, I'm actually surprised that a lot of people uh, call the Black Mamba like the Black Horse of Eurovision 2021. Like they didn't expect that the Black Mamba will be in the final. I'm actually surprised. I noticed, I felt that this is the true finalist. I liked it since the beginning and I actually surprised that people like, oh, Portuguese, really cool performance. I like it. I have to vote for it. Like, what were you doing previously? It's actually really beautiful. Maybe the staging like increased this attention to this group because it was perfect. I I was watching a short movie with really beautiful story. So first of all, this entry, black and white entry, it's like Hollywood in 1930s and we're just sitting somewhere drinking our cocktails and watching this wonderful love story. I actually think this is about the changes when love comes into your life. We see two stages and the first one is rainy kind of, it's dark, something like that. And when we see, you know, this hologram of the lady and the front man uh, follows her and his life changes. He is inspired. He is over the moon. He is singing, you know, louder. He is playing the guitar. So he is just inspired by her. And this is what love makes with us actually after this performance i just uh wanna you know fall in love <laughs> yeah it's a good motivation thank you the black mamba uh, secondly uh, let's talk about this beautiful voice what are you doing it's touching it's like covering you and you just want to stay and listen to it all the time very beautiful. Um, it's a kind of, you know, prince wise timbre and beautiful, really cool. Okay, choir of voices. This is also one of my favorite parts. So thank you the Black Mamba. Actually, the orchestra sounds beautiful. The voice is beautiful. The choir is beautiful. The staging. It's beautiful, everything is beautiful and, and everything is about authenticity. I guess this is why the Black Mamba or No has more chances in this, you know, top. I guess it's a really worthy performance. One of the best this year. There are a lot of them, but the Black Mamba occupies this place and I wish them good luck, really. So please tell me, what do you think about the performance? Did you like it? What about the song? Are you into this jazz sound? Are you into this voice? Are you into the Black Mamba? I'm waiting for your feedback and I'm gonna support Portugal this Saturday. So stay tuned and just share with me your thoughts, okay?